Welcome to Geeker. Today, we're going to learn how to use a VLOOKUP in Excel. So let's get started. So in this example, we're going to use a VLOOKUP to match the account number that goes with the specific vendor. So as you can see here, I've already pulled all of the vendors' names and I've already listed the account number that they belong to, okay? So when I do a VLOOKUP, I wanna make sure that I have this set up first. So now when I come over here to insert this account number, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna say equals VLOOKUP Parenthesis. Now, the first thing it's going to say is what is the lookup value? It wants to know what am I looking for first? So I want to know what the account number is to the vendor, which is in this case CVS. So I click on that. Then I hit comma. Now it's saying where am I going to find the answer to this question that you have? In this scenario, it's right over here. And I'm going to click right here onto these two um, columns. Then I'm going to hit comma. Now, when you do a VLOOKUP, you need to know what column is this referencing. So where do I find the exact answer? So in this particular example, we have column one and we have column two. My answer, which is I want to know the account number, is sitting in column two. So I'm going to hit two and then comma zero. Now I put zero because I want it to be an exact match. And I'm just going to hit parenthesis and then I'm going to hit enter. And as you can see, it's saying, hey, based on the information that you gave us, CVS belongs to account number 6406. And then I'm just going to click, double click on this corner. And there you see, it pulled all of the account numbers. So this is just a really quick and easy way to know how to do a VLOOKUP in Excel. I hope you guys found this video helpful and make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel for more helpful tips.